Hello, this is Dr. Ken Morlino at Wilmington University. The purpose of this short video is to introduce you to my accounting lab, which supports our managerial accounting course. I will walk you through the features of my accounting lab, along with available resources that come with your my accounting lab registration. Upon entering, after registration, upon entering your account, My Accounting Lab course, you will see a view very similar to this. You will see a left-hand menu with all of these items, with the exception of instructor tools. You will see a calendar on the landing page that can be adjusted by clicking on the arrows. And if you click on the arrows, you will see that certain items are due on certain dates. In this particular case, November 3rd, there are items that are due. Before we get into the actual assignments that you will be completing in my accounting lab, let's take a look at some of the resources that come with your registration. First is the e-text. With your registration, you have available to you the full uh, e-version of our textbook, and that is available from this link. In addition, there are additional resources that are available to you, including the PowerPoints for every chapter in the book. Just select the PowerPoint that you want and find now and you'll get access to that file. The third resource that's available to you is Study Plan. Study Plan is a great place for you to practice just about any problem that you wish to practice. You can access problems by clicking on the View All Chapters item, go to the chapter that you wish to, to find a problem, Select the area, the type of problem that you want, and then you will actually get access to problems where you can practice any one of these particular problems, and which has no impact on your grade. And so this is a great way for you to actually practice and build competency in the concepts prior to you completing the graded homework. Finally, let's talk about the actual assignments that you will be completing in my accounting lab. There are two types of assignments, homework problems and short quizzes for each particular chapter. So when I click on assignments, I get to this page and I can select either the homework or the quizzes and tests for our course. Okay. In, in either area, you will see the, the actual assignment and its due date. Homework for our course, uh, for each chapter, there are between three to five problems that are assigned. Uh, homework does not have to be completed in one sitting. Uh, week one homework problems, you'll have a few attempts, but for each homework problem, you can save your work, but you are restricted in the number of attempts for each particular problem. That is why study plan is recommended for the area in which you can practice your homework problems. For each chapter, there's a short quiz, and generally there will be eight questions that are multiple choice or true-false. Quizzes must be taken in one sitting and reflect your readings of the chapter. I hope that you find this short introduction to my accounting lab valuable and a way that you can help uh, familiarize yourself with this application. It may take some time to click around, experiment with some things, but I think you'll find that this is a valuable addition to our course and a great way to build your skills with managerial accounting. If you have an uh, any questions, please email your instructor. Thank you for, time and, and for your time and for listening.